Awakens. Each world is worse than the last. Perhaps, ah, but perhaps there's a glimmer of hope. Hi. Okay, Ada status awaiting input. Greatness abounds, founders, founders have blessed. Technology for anti-creeper spare decoded. Praise be the founders. Superfluous software anomaly has yielded some productive results. Delayed deletion for one additional cycle. Spare technology should be immediately utilized for primary objective. Mission priority nullification. Other priorities suspended. Brothers, I do not like how this is progressing. We must not adopt the ways of those who have lost the path. Anti-creeper is balanced, I concur, but to weaponize it in such a way will surely only uh, will surely only lead to more conflict. We should embrace sacrifice and perhaps that will persuade the others for our good intentions. Go in pre peace, travelers. Okay, so let's take a look. So I, I'm gonna operate under the assumption that it re. Ooh, what is this stuff? I don't know. It's like weird. Oh, those are digitalis towers, probably. Okay, one way or another, we probably want to slap that down right off the bat. Priority notification. Crimson Creeper generation detected. Crimson Creeper is hard hardened and resistant to known rep weaponry. Utilize anti-creeper and superior tactical maneuvers to dominate the Crimson. Mission priority nullification. All other priorities suspended. Imagine that. Sarge and I agree for a change. To get busy, make a lot of miners to set to blue light. They'll be needed for the new sprayer weapon. What if I don't want it? What if I want Terp? I miss Terp. Even on slopes, it might actually be putting Soylent down. Let's see. Let's just let that go. We should have a bunch in storage, yeah? Nope, we had 10 in storage. Oh, it's okay. It'll pay for itself pretty quick. I was really expecting that Ultrac would actually have a lot more space in it than it did. Alright, whatever. Okay, so who wants miners? Here's the thing. Okay. I'm just going to slap that there. There we go. So I'm going to start with the miners. And we'll get it rolling. Unfortunately, probably better that I actually go slow. And build them one at a time. But I'm just, I'm just lazy. Alright, so let's take a look at this. I'm really curious about Crimson Creeper. And how resistant it is. Because I don't want to be forced to use Anti-Creeper. I'm real lazy about that business. Okay. What is this thing? AC Source. Oh, Anti-Creeper. And New Tech. Whatever it is, we'll leave it for later. Uh, let's see. Structure. Miner. Hey. I'll put that down perfectly. If I put that there, that should cover the rest of the mine. Nope. 
There's one more miner there. Uh, let's see. There we go. That should cover the rest of the mine. Okay, so yeah, let's let's see how effective the the red stuff is. And I doubt I'm going to be able to stop this necessarily. Oh. Okay. Other thing to note, we do have we do have bad boys coming in. How long until you fire? In about a minute. Can I put it anywhere else? Nah. This will have to do. Ah, right. I am donked if I don't actually have the fa factory down. Okay, let's take a look at this. It's really tempting to try and charge down this direction, but I think I'm I think I'm going to hold on to that just for a second and just get a bunch of miners down. Let's see. Let's just go nuts. Because as soon as those mines are done, we can start aggressively dealing with the rest of this. So, how resistant is Crimson Creeper? Fairly resistant. Okay. I'm going to I'm going to start with the easy option of use and abuse mortars, keep them off my front door. Plop a missile there. I think we only actually have what? Two missile batteries? Oh. And what wait, oh, they're just trying to expand what they've got instead of immediate immediately attacking me. Okay. Well, let's... Let's confer at least a number of these into blueite. And get a sprayer down. Can I rotate? No. Okay, so next up, tower. Probably actually get some pylons down. That there. Oh, yeah. Okay, so the Crimson Creeper is more durable. Wow. Okay, yeah, it's considerably more durable. That's going to make Cannon Rushes... Not actually that hard. I was a little worried, but it looks like I can I can actually just bypass the Crimson Creeper spots. And that should be enough. Alright. So I'm just gonna try and utilize the high ground for a moment. I wanna head for whatever this is. How much blue eye do I have? The answer is loads. Well, alright. I didn't really use Anti-Creeper much in, uh, in Creeper World 3. I guess today is the day that I switched that up a bit. Okay, so where are they aiming? Looks like mostly into the heart of my... No, it looks like they're mostly just trying to beef themselves up. One there. Everything else is golden. 
Okay, structure, pylon. Is that connected? That is. Okay, let's... I'm just going to move that one down. Because it looks like pylon lines are blocked by line of sight. Okay, next up, mortars. I'm just going to slap a bunch of mortars up. All right. Now that we've got this relatively handled, it's not perfect. But I think we're fine. Cannons. And if I can keep him off this barrier... Hell, if I can get up to that mountain, we get a lot more resources. Yeah, I think we're good. Crimson Creeper definitely keep keeps the enemies off. Or it it gives them an advantage that I'm I'm not going to be able to exploit particularly well, or at least uh ignore. Okay. I'm just gonna kind of extend that there. I don't think they're ever gonna expand up this direction, but I'm gonna just in case. I guess we should probably also just slap down a number of towers just to get more Soylent production. Uh, let's see. How are we doing on Blue Eye? I can probably actually reclaim some of this. I'm curious. Can I actually see my use statistics? I wish so. But I don't see it. Alright. It's fine. Let's wait for those cannons to finish and keep kind of expanding out this direction. Grab a couple of these. I might as well take this location and actually hold it. Get the wall back up. Okay. Especially while I've got this laser barricade that I can potentially use. So what is what does this do exactly? AC source. It looks like I have to power it. Interesting. Uh, let's see. Well, yeah, these guys will be fine if I just put them there. Uh, let's see. Can I? Nope. Nope. There we go. Oh, the big issue is... No, that didn't work. Okay. So this is like a weird hill thing. Uh, that's annoying. Okay, so in that case, I'm just going to have that hang out here. Is this... Let's see. Dispatch or always on. Let me just turn this one on always on. It doesn't look like the AC sprayers are nearly, nearly as aggressive as I'd like them to be, but that's okay. All right, you guys. So, I guess it's not a big problem. What I can do is just have these guys roll in over here. So if I can, I mean, honestly, if I can take out the shooter and get to this emitter that solves 90% of our Crimson Creeper and I can just scoot in, this means more sprayers. True. Okay. Well, this area looks like it actually got solved pretty quick. Let's see. Slap some towers down. 
And since this isn't an emitter, we won't have to worry about it. Alright. Well, the first rush went out, went off without a hitch. Not that I really expected anything different. This is... It's like... I, I said this earlier. I'm looking forward to when we get out of the tutorial. Because there's always kind of like a difficulty jump when it stops trying to... You know, teach you the most basic tactics in this game. Uh, let's see. Build another missile there. And then pop a nullifier. Okay. I guess in retrospect, I can't I can't pull all of these. I'm gonna have to leave a couple of them along the edges here, otherwise it's gonna creep up on me. Har. Okay. Tower there, tower there. Yeah, let's let's just uh, solve the Crimson Creeper problem the easy way. Just leave no creeper. Whoops. There we go. A leaf no creeper. Yeah, they look really cool, actually. All right, you here. Let's get a nullifier down. Let me see. What do we got? So this area is still kind of full. Oh right. I was gonna. I was gonna destroy this structure. Pylon. Get some uh, sneaky towers all over the place. Right, how's this area looking? Nice and convenient. Oh, and if they dry up, yeah, they they really do just dry up there. Another delicate. Another totem. Now, is this flowing in from anywhere? Because I'm seeing it move around. Uh, I guess easy answer. Let's just build a handful of mortars out here. There we go. Uh, let's see. I have one missile launcher. We should fix that. Admittedly, we also only have one thing flying in, so I think this singular missile launcher should be enough. But you never know. Okay. Do I do I grab these guys? Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna slap them over here. Because what I'd like to do is kind of deplete major areas where the creep is still kind of collecting here, just so I can go back to focusing on one area and one area alone. I guess the other thing I could do is just ignore it entirely. I really need the relay tower to be right here. Nowhere else. Eh. Okay, didn't quite work. Let's slap them here. Yeah, there's just enough flowing in from up high. This didn't quite work out the way I wanted it to. I was hoping I'd be able to get that singular relay down, and then we'd be good. But alas. Okay. I'm going to move the missile launchers. I'm 
Okay, let's try this again, but instead of just chucking myself there, I'll start with this. As it's doing. I love how this singular turret is just... Uh, it's submerged. Okay. Anyway, let's let's start with just basic towers. Getting the pylon down probably is the other issue. Uh, let's see. You. And you. So far, so good. Now I should be able to take this with zero troubles. Right, so far, so good. I am repeating myself. It is fine. This is what happens whenever I play tactical games. My brain starts shutting down a little bit, and the commentary sections of my brain are just like, What? What am I doing? Ah, shoot. And it just doesn't recover for a while. It's a... I'd say it's a problem. It's not. I'm fine with it. And I'm assuming most people kind of expect that out of strategy games. I think most most of the channels that I know that do really good commentary on strategy games are usually the ones that do it in post after the, after the fact. You know, talking about what they're doing is supposed to like... Or talking about what they did is supposed to talking strictly about what they're doing in the moment. Let's see. Oh. Might lose a tower here. That's okay, I can also just pull these out. Oof. Well. Uh, let's see. Maybe what I should do. actually bring some of these back because yeah clearing this area out turned out to be a bit of a mis well not a mistake oh, just in my way there we go because yeah landing them here splashed it out so they they pushed back into other areas uh let's see this is fine i didn't need this many cannons anyway Okay, everything else is pretty good. Let's see. Are we golden? Yeah. Now I can probably land down here. Okay, let's... Let's start slapping just towers all over the place. My spider web grows. It's ugly, but it's so very functional. You know, actually, there's two games out today that involve a fair bit of like weird spider network stuff going on. Because Per Aspera also came out. I would like to get back and finish that. But time. It's not on my side. All right. I got enough juice. Weapon. Cannon. Make me more cannon. We've got the big rush. Let's see. You. You go clear that out. I just don't like that having that little bit of creeper just sitting around. It always just doesn't feel good to me. I'll use that as a secondary staging area. What else? What other cannons here are not actually being used? Kind of, kind of a lot of them. Okay. There we go. I guess the other thing I should probably do is actually extend some pylons. Let's see. Pylon there. Py pylon there. There we go. 
Just a slightly faster path. There we go. Anything else? You. There. Do we think... Oh. Hi. No, we're not done. Data analyzer initiated. Analysis of data record follows. Chrono dating indicates the age of over 8,000 standard Earth years. Plain text rec record follows. Personal log, uh, personal log, Monty Joven. Kyra, the founders would be proud. I think I've identified a weakness in the Creeper. The prophecy says the Creeper will prevail, but we shall continue in other lands. I believe this discovery might be the key to unlocking those other lands. Data on the discovery is forthcoming. I hope all remains well with you and the children. I wish I could be there, but this work is critically important. I hope you understand. I will be with you soon. Ugh. I wonder if he ever made it to his family. This tech, this message, the language, it's all very human, but how? Also, Joven? Like, does he not recognize the familial relate? Well, it's fine. Uh, let's see. How many of these can I actually squeeze in here? Not many. Unfortunately, this mountaintop is kind of atrocious. Gonna be able to get like a grand scheme of five mines on here. Ah, there's so much space, so wasted. Oh, let's get a refinery up in here too. Not that I really have much of a need for a refinery at this point. Oh, but we do need lift lifting to activate things. Oh. Okay. You know, here's a question. Normally when I do my, my turret rush, I have these. Why don't we, seeing as we have so much, let's grab some sprayers. Some. Let's get a bunch of sprayers down and see, see what happens when I do the turret rush. But it's not just turrets, because I was mixing in mortars a little bit there. And I think it kind of helped, but it didn't really, it wasn't that necessary. But the anti, uh, the anti creeper, the actual turrets could be really interesting. Oh, you can create a squad. That's cool. All right, onwards. The only problem is, these are going to be on their own. I guess actually, let's just let's just launch them over here. We're going to move up the backside, take out the last launcher. Because I've, I've already got a, a fairly functional... Oops. I've already got a fairly functional defense just going up this entire direction. I guess I could have also gone up the middle, but the Crimson Creeper is going away from this area. Oh, something's noisy. Okay, weapon nullifier. Okay, we should pull you back. And you back. Let's see, I guess we don't need another anti-missile thing. There we go. Grand scheme of things, this strategy works great. Instead of cannon rushing all the way to my objective, cannon rushing in smaller intervals might work better. Let's see, we're allowed to talk spoilers? Please don't. Especially not for this game. I Potentially talking about how plot stuff works with Creeper World 3? Uh, using stuff from Creeper World 3 and Particle Fleet, like, that's probably okay. Seeing as I've... I played the heck out of those.
Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave a couple. Cause yeah, this immediately got buried. In a bad way. Oh. Well, there goes the nullifier. Okay. Build another nullifier slightly further back. Should have done that to begin with. Okay. These should be fine. They've got loads of ammo. Uh, let's see. Any of these particularly injured? Not right now, no. Yeah, I knew I shouldn't have picked up all of them. one or two of these. We'll see. I think a lot of them are just out of juice. Right, I'll see what I can do. Because these are not. These should be... You should be good to go. Ah, I took it, took it out. All right, screw it. Let's go cheap. Because all we need is some amount of power rolling into this entire area. I was trying to go with the relays because they're faster, but we need to build fast. Okay, the losses are painful. Okay. These guys are cut off. Let's pull them back. Alright. That'll have to be good enough. Let's, let's just let him recover. And then we'll take this back section and then just roll it in. Uh, let's see. Well, you know what? What else have we got? There we go. Pile on. Yeah, I figured as much. Can I take that, though? Because if I can get a pylon right in there, that'd do the trick. These are probably fine. Okay. Yeah, let's let's get up and in in here. Okay, so the pylon I tried putting down didn't actually function. But I think this time we've got a much stronger leg to stand on. We've already got the We've already got the towers down as needed. And so we're not going to run out of juice in the middle of fighting here. Uh, let's see. We are running out of juice, though. Let's, let's get one or two anti-creeper sprayers. There we go. Now we got it. All right, weapon, nullifier. There's absolutely a spot here. Oh, but it's not within range. There we go. All right, I think we got it pretty much cowed. Hey, thank you Cryerus for the raid and the sub for the 36 month resub. Damn, how am I enjoying the spicy water? Well, I'm crushing it to no small degree, so I'm enjoying it thoroughly. I've, I, ever since 
Oh, shoot, what is it? Ever since Farber in Creeper World 3, I've just, like, absolutely become the... the advocate of the cannon rush, and it is... Uh, it hasn't really failed me. Okay, let's... Let's start slapping this down. I probably should have been just doing this a long time ago. Okay. So this is clear. Bam! Yeah, there's no more there's no more creeper flowing into this space anyway. Uh Farber sucks. Glad you found your niche. I Farber was stressful. Mainly just because there was a time limit. Beyond that, Farber was actually quite easy. It was just the, like, suddenly, oh, this game actually has a time limit for once. I'm not used to that. How do I cope? Oh, yeah. Cannon Rush. I'm looking forward to the harder, like, custom maps. Once we get in. So I really want to see if I can flex what I got. Because I really liked the, uh, the non-plot cu custom maps in the demo. The, the one that actually gave, like, a bunch of anti-creeper is kind of a, uh, uh a balancing thing. Uh, just for new players. Like, that one was really fun to do. So what does Crimson Creeper do? It's resistant to weapons, so you can't really rush through it as well. I needed a lot more guns to actually, you know, take it out. Or, you just go around like what I did. There we go. Let's see, what else have I missed? I've missed a couple of things. Thank you, Daybot, for the sub and welcome in. Thank you, Dragon Venom 97 for the 20 month resub. And of course, thank you, Cryos, for the raid and the sub to sub. All right, now we just wait. And I think we're done, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bam, rift jump. All right, hints. Nope, no extra plot. All right, that's fine. Oh, this one looks fun. Things are getting real and getting dangerous. Looks like I got a fort in the center and I have to keep them off. 